And now we have a special interview here. More and more women are using the Internet to stay connected, uh, build communities, and share ideas. And today we're joined live by Internet expert Regina Lewis and the newest It Girl online, that girl, Marla Thomas. Thanks for being with News Channel 18 this morning, ladies. Hi, good morning. Well, you know, more and more women are logging on, in particular moms. Some, something like 33 million moms are logging online. Uh, Regina, what's sort of the push behind that? Well, I think moms are very tech savvy these days. They're trying to juggle a lot of things. They go online for practical reasons. They go on to get connected and entertained, where Marlo is doing masterfully on her new site, MarloThomas.com. So I think it makes perfect sense that moms would be online in droves. They're also getting increasingly social on sites like Facebook, and they're looking for good content. You know, they're all they're very judicious about what they watch. So. For a long time, the Internet had a lot of what they call user-generated content, cat videos, things like that on the YouTubes of the world. Now, of course, there are also fully produced movies and shows, but there's a big section in the middle that really begs for good content that's interactive, and who better to do that than someone like Marlo, <laughs> who's known for creating masterful content, which isn't easy, by the way. That's the truth. And actually, Marlo, I was on your website yesterday, and it was, it was really cool because it seems to be able to talk to women of all ages. You had a little bit for everyone. You know, I'm almost 30, but it was also something that my mom could watch as well. What was the idea behind MarloThomas.com? Well, I want to communicate with a big community of women. I have been having a conversation with women ever since That Girl and Free to Be You and Me and my books and St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. But I've always felt that I live behind a one-way mirror where everybody got to look through it at me, but I never got to look back. But now it's so interactive. I'm talking to women, they're talking to me, they're talking to each other. And that's what's very exciting to me, is to get the conversation started and to see women start to talk to each other even when I'm not there. That means that we're building a community. And I'm very excited because AOL is such a great partner. I told them from the beginning I wanted to do something called Mondays with Marlo, where every Monday I would be on live and I'd have a stream live coming at me of, of people's questions and so they could see that I really was answering their questions directly because so many celebrity sites I'm sorry to say you know somebody else is writing in a back room but I'm uh, completely focused and completely engaged in this uh, we're doing uh, we're, we're highlighting heroes and any anybody from all over the country can nominate a woman that they think is a hero in their neighborhood and we're videoing them we we do girls night out which means we put a group, group of women in a room and we talk about all the things that matter to us money sex romance elderly parents kids who won't leave home the <laughs> empty nest shopping girlfriends unfaithfulness I mean all of it and I I really did this because when I was going out on the web I wasn't finding anything for me. Mm -hmm. So this really is a place for women over 35, um, and I'm glad younger women like it too, but it really is a place where we can start talking about what's irking us. You know, and a lot of women have not stopped dreaming, and I'm one of them. I want to keep dreaming, and I want to encourage other women that they should get in. Their life is not over at 40. Yeah, it's, that's, there's plenty that's the to truth. do yet. Well, you know, Marla, you, you taught me that women can be almost anything they want to be. Because <laughs> my sister and I grew up with Free to Be You and Me, and it's very inspirational, and so is your website. So thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. And we will see Joe LePage.